if you have been looking to become a nurse and you don't even know where to start maybe you have a degree already and you're trying to transition into nursing or you just have maybe a diploma or secondary school certificate and you're trying to see if you can study nursing in the united states or canada or somewhere else this video is going to be very helpful for you i'm going to be sharing a couple of options that are available out there and how you can start the process and ultimately find yourself in any of these countries and become a nurse. So there are three routes that I'm going to be talking about here that I believe is very, very interesting. And I believe so many people may not even be thinking of this, but I believe that if you listen up and actually consider it, maybe you know someone that this will benefit or maybe it benefits you watching this video. So the first one is with a school in Canada. So this school, they have certificate programs and they have diploma programs and the interesting thing with those schools is that you are qualified for postgraduate work permit when you finish any of those courses there is a program called practice nurse in Canada and that program in this particular school allows international students who have studied visa if you end up going for any of the certificate programs and what you are ultimately looking forward to join is nursing then maybe after studying after one year you can actually ask to transfer to that particular program because you have a valid visa and then when you get into that practice nursing then you can continue your nursing career from there and one thing about Canada is if you have their education it's a little easier for us to get into their nursing program right because you get the certificate you get the license and you get into it a lot of people are not thinking about this but this is genius people that are doing it I believe that maybe someone an insider shares something with them so to summarize about this particular one is that first of all you get a program i would say her administration health administration program at the, the school is george brown university i'm going to leave the link in the description and you can get into that particular program and they they have an option for for winter 2025 so when you get into that program and you love the program you can decide to continue to in that but the reason for this video is how you can become a nurse in the shortest possible time so i believe that if you have started the program already you have your visa f1 visa and then you are already in canada then you can app apply for this practice nurse in the same school so because they have those two programs i believe it will be easy for you to for to transition from that your program to that one they also have the personal support worker and you know that this is also lucrative or it's easy for you to get a job in Canada in this process so but those ones they require that someone already has an F1 visa and is residing in Canada so when you go through this route of a diploma program which is also good so assuming you change your mind you don't want to transition into nursing as well you after studying that because you also have an option to work as well okay so that is the number one the second one is for the US so you know I've been talking about a lot of routes to study nursing in the United States for instance if you already have a degree and your degree is in any other course nursing accelerated BSN program a lot of people are not able to do this because you need to pass through some prerequisite to get in there but the interesting thing is that if you study courses that are related to nursing like or have nursing that we expose you to take certain prerequisite then you don't need it so you just need to apply for the ABSN and if there are little more courses they want you to take then you just complete it but if you study courses like anatomy physiology all these uh, medical related courses but they are not nursing but you want to transition into nursing you need to just start the process and see what that school will tell you i shared a video giving you an example of a school that said contact us with your student copy and if you're qualified then you can go through the process so you don't even have to start spending in the beginning of your journey you need to find out if you're qualified and then if you want to go through that a lot of people are also worried about the fees but i've also shared here that i've I've partnered with companies like if you're interested in the first one and funding is your problem I and my team we are helping people who already have the admission letter will help you with scholarship options and, and funding option for international students so 
it is no longer a barrier if you don't have fees school fees right it is no longer a barrier you just need to start the process you need to save up for maybe the application fees you need to save up for the maybe the requirements that you don't have but once you get admission if you're really serious get admission and you have your admission letter a lot of companies are beginning to help international students and we can help you to you know see if you qualify for any of these funding opportunities and get into it so guys accelerated nursing program is not an exception but you need to get in okay and then when you have your admission letter then we can look at other options and one thing i know is that if you're registered not you how you stand a higher chance compared to other people who are studying other courses getting a job and getting work permits or green card if it is the united states so that's the second option the third option is for people who want to start nursing from scratch so if you want to start nursing from scratch there is associate degree in nursing and there are schools that you can apply to in the u.s that will that have that associate degree in nursing and they are helping international students as well to get into the program it's competitive but it's good for you to know that this actually you know yeah, is out there and you can get into nursing through the associate degree in nursing so you just need to apply you need to have your IELTS here sometimes they exempt countries like Ghana Kenya Nigeria from submitting the IELTS but then you need to also qualify because even in 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 in, in the US I'm even surprised that a lot of people also want to get into nursing and you have to meet the requirement and get into it but the thing is that you should know that there is something called associate degree in nursing that you can look to because because some people will be going to RA to BSN, BSN and they are not qualified or going to master's degree and all of that but if you can get into the associate degree in nursing it's a you can you are qualified to write your NCLEX after that and then you can transition to bachelor's after that 